Hey YouTube, this is Grand Mimi 4 and this is inside the bag of my latest haul. Uh, yeah, this was a very interesting haul. I tried explaining this in writing to make a Freakazoid and she said it took her 10 minutes to figure out what the heck I was talking about. So I figured I better go ahead and make a video. So keep watching and I'll show you exactly what all this means. I found out a couple of days ago that my Island Margarita was a summer favorite or a summer fragrance or whatever. Uh, yeah, I'd gone out to the website and didn't see it so I'm thinking whoa what's going on what are they doing with my island margarita so I called the store they didn't know so I'm like oh okay I gotta go in there and get some island margarita but then also how can I make a educational video from this so the purpose of the video is to number one for me to get my island margarita number two for you to show you how to get 10 for $20. They're advertising right now hand soaps 7 for $20. Uh, and I'm going to show you some other stuff too. A, this is a very interesting um, haul. So stay tuned and um, I'll break it down for you. Okay? Keep watching. Bath and Body Works current special on their hand soaps is 5 for 15 or 7 for 20. Well, I want to show you how you can get 10 for 20. Well, once you make your 7, of course, each subsequent one, that's every one after the first 7, will be the same price as the first 7, which means um, 20 divided by 7 is $2.86, 85 cents, whatever. So then that means that the additional 3 will also be $2.86. Okay, so that came out to like $20.48. And my point was, or my objective, was to make it to $30. Because then I would use a survey. So with the surveys, as you know, if you spend thirty dollars you get ten dollars off. Um, I keep these in my wallet. I usually go ahead and call them in so all I have to do is just put the number on there. I bought an anti-bag holder and of course an island margarita um, pocket bag that made my purchase thirty dollars and some change. I used my survey or I was yeah I used my survey but now here's what happened. While the cashier was ringing me up she actually planted a seed. What she was thinking is that the special they have going is if you spend $25, I thought it was 30, but if you spend $25, you get a free lookbook. Okay? Yeah, makes sense. And then in the lookbook is that coupon, I've torn it out now, but it's that coupon that says um, spend $15 or more and you get a free aromatherapy item. Yeah, here it is. Right here. This one. Um, free aromatherapy or true blue spa item of your choice with any purchase of $15 or more. Okay, so she was going to use that which meant I could have got a free aromatherapy item. Okay, now mind you, take this out of the equation for now because this is what was in my head to use my survey. So I did. I bought this. I got my uh, 10 for $20. Okay? But I changed my mind. Stay tuned. I'll be right back. Okay, so yeah. I changed my mind. I hadn't even gotten out of the mall good and I started thinking about what she said and I'm like, uh oh, wait a minute, did I make the best deal? I'm like, uh, no, I did not make the best deal. 
because I only got saved, well, I saved ten dollars out of pocket money, but she was gonna give me an aromatherapy item and a new lookbook with all these coupons. So I went back in the store. Yep, I sure did. And here is what I did then. I returned all of it. What we ended up doing, still, the seven, um, I'm sorry, no, the ten hand soaps were $2.86 each. Okay. I went ahead and had her ring this up. I didn't really need it, but I didn't want to change their numbers for the night, so I kept that. Now, because I'd spent over $25, I got a free lookbook. Okay, and she took the coupon out of there and gave me a free aromatherapy item for spending $15. On this one, I could only use one um, coupon. So, I, uh, um, so yeah, that's what I did. And before I could get out of the mall again, I had another thought, but I didn't go back this time. I said, no, I'm, I'm not going back. I'm going to keep what I got. Uh, so, am I going to be satisfied with these guys? I don't know yet. I'm still thinking about it because I also worked out another way to do this in my head. Um, now, mind you, on this transaction, I did end up um, spending $30. Okay, so yeah, it's ten dollars um, more than I did in my initial transaction, but I got that money back in product here because uh, this was thirteen, and I also got that money back in the additional coupons in the book. Specifically, the ones I'm looking at is the um, signature body care item with any purchase. And then the other one I'm looking at is the holiday traditions body care item with any purchase. And of course there's a four ounce candle. So for the ten dollars that I put back into it, um, I got these. Okay? Uh, so that justifies that reason for me not going, for me actually um, going back and making the exchange. Okie dokie. So that's why I always tell you, plan your trips. Because something can always happen to change your mind.